All right, guys, so I'm going to go through seven of the most overused characters and how to counter them. All right up, first off is Bastion. Right, this guy is class, his defense, known for basically being a turret. Okay, and basically how to counter, uh, though many consider Bastion the cheapest player in the game due to his turret form and the ability to heal himself, he's far from unbeatable. Luckily for opposing players, both these seemingly overpowered abilities have the same weakness. They temporarily immobilize the, the bird-loving robot. All right. So if you want to challenge Bastion head-on, um, best bet is Gen Genji, a character who can uh, reflect bullets back at Bastion with his futuristic swordplay. Tanks like Diva and Reinhardt can bring quick cover to a teammate uh, attempting to bring Bastion down. Um, but they're more of a they're more of a distraction than an actual counter. Be sure an ally is nearby uh, to dole out some sort of damage if you choose the tank approach. Um, for more stealthy, close-range combat, you should look towards characters like Tracer and Reaper, who can uh, materialize behind Bastion and do some serious damage. If, you, if you're not keen on potentially uh, becoming riddled with bullet holes, uh, you can always spring a Widowmaker or Hanzo uh, set up shop uh, out of sight and let fly a few devastating shops to uh, dism dismantle everyone's least favorite play of the game winner definitely okay and um, also the junk rat and pharaoh who have the firepower to make short work of bastion uh just be sneaky other other um also roadhog who can use his chain hook to take bastion out of his turret mode okay all right next up we have junk rat okay class he is defense again is known for loving grenades and hunting you down with a tire, yeah, basically. Everyone's favorite Aussie peg leg sure is annoying. Chances are you've encountered a junk rat or two who will spam his trademark grenades until he racks up enough points to send rip, send, send rip tire rolling into battle. Uh, then it's time to run for your life or take it out before it goes off if you're feeling ballsy. It, it can certainly be frustrating going against him. Okay. Jung rats grenades may be powerful, but they're not the easiest to aim. At long distance, they have a have a bit of a kickback. If you're if you're far from the opposing junk rat, you should approach in a separate pattern of sorts to throw off his aim. Getting up is getting up in his face is the way to take him down. As mentioned, Bastion guide a tracer or reaper as you as you go to when you need to approach it with surprise. Heroes with explosive close range power like McCree or Farah on Roadhog. Are also a solid choice. Just be sure you don't walk in right into a junk rat's uh, patented bear traps while you try to avoid his blasts. Okay, snipers like Widowmaker and Hanzo can gain the upper hand on junk rat from afar. Uh, Torbron can also be handy as his turret can take junk rat's wheel of doom before it reaches anyone. Okay, guys. So this time we have Widowmaker. Right, excellent sniper. Okay, class defense known for camping and scoping. Okay. Uh, how to counter, Widowmaker is the only hero in Overwatch who can scope it in, in on its targets. This makes her a very, uh, very advantageous character to have on one's team. Since uh, you've stumbled upon a Widowmaker focused intently on some far off foe and gleefully taking her out from close range. Okay, Unfortunately, most smart Widowmaker players will do their best to keep a distance at all times. If you do manage to get close, chances are uh, you can put a hurting on her. If you're lucky enough to spy Widowmaker before she takes aim, you can raise to her level with the, with the right choices. Okay, Extrange, uh, Estrange Ninja Brother Genji and Hanzo can both climb walls uh, through Genji's far better up close combat, uh, while other heroes like Winston, Farrah and Devo can, can take a vertical leap uh, to get a better vantage point. Widowmaker does have one of the lowest health pools in the game, so it won't take much to deplete her life. Okay. Um, from a defensive position, Reinhardt can do a lot to slow down a Widowmaker kill streak due to his shield ability to take quite a few shots off her before shattering. Soldier 76, class offense. Okay, known for classic FPS skills. Basically, COD playing is this. That's the closest you're going to get to playing COD. Okay, how to counter Soldier 76 is one average GI Joe, but that's why everyone feels so comfortable with him. He's the safest choice for newcomers. Thus, his appearance as a default Overwatch tutorial character is no wonder he seems to be popping up in most matches. Uh, no one side or the other. Um, no one side or the other. He, due to Soldier 76 all-round average ability, there isn't any. There isn't really anyone here that stands out of the best or worst to match up. 
just out of any characters can make a dent in his armor if they play the specific strengths. As 76 has the capacity to both sprint and heal himself, as well as others, it is a good idea to stay on top of him as a team. If you're after him solo, you want to you want a more agile fight like Genji or Tracer on his tail. Lucio's ability to increase other players' speed can also be a helpful buff when trying to keep up with 76. So stay clear out of his special uh, when he locks on so aim aim button. It will, it will lock onto opposing characters in sight and take them out. Okay, so 76 can't run if he's stunned. Okay, try Roadhog, Chains Hook, or Reinhardt special to slow him down. Okay, the uh, earthquake thing. Reaper. Everyone loves Reaper. Okay, class, offense. No for manifesting nearby and murdering you. Okay, had a counter. Two guns are always better than one, and Reaper regulars are well aware of this. Okay, the popular Spectre of Death is handy for surprise attacks due to his shadow step which allows him to mark a spot and warp around on command, look out behind you. Okay, um, the Excel against the King of, of Angst, uh, you'll need to be able to take a hit or, to, or be able to stop him dead in his tracks. When it comes to a knockback, there aren't many better than Divas and Reinhardt's, okay? both which have fast acting shields and a solid amount of health. Other, on the other hand, um, on the other hand, characters like McCree or Mai can, fa can phase Reaper uh, long enough with the stun and freeze abilities to leave him defenseless uh, to their more powerful attacks. Just be sure in time uh, your assault precisely as Reaper's wrath form makes him momentarily vulnerable. Take fire once he's back in the vulnerable solid form. Okay. Players have found that Farah has a good average ab over Reaper with explosive attacks and maneuverability. Roadhog, yeah, everyone hates this guy, even though he's epic. Okay, class is a tank, okay, known for the old stunning gun. Had a candle road ho Roadhog. Is one big pig, his shotgun blast and chain hook make him one of the most satisfying characters for newbies and a constant aggravation for everyone. Uh, with a large health pool and a healing ability to boot, he's not one of the easiest opponents to put into the ground. Roadhog is another character who doesn't really have a definitive group of, of her heroes who can carry him with ease. Chances are you'll be best off with the tank heroes that have a high health uh, to begin with, such as Winston, Reinhardt and Diva. Uh, even other Roadhog isn't a terrible idea. If you want to keep your distance, you should uh, lean to a Torbjorn with a well-placed turret and armor packs on tap. Torbjorn can help himself and others stay alive long enough to turn Roadhog into bacon. Okay, um, Many have started uh, stated that Mai is a wonderful counter to Roadhog as he is a perfect target for her icy blasts. Reinhardt. I got the gold skin in one of the loot boxes. It looks epic. Okay, right, so he's a tank. He is known for having a ridiculously large shield how to counter no one is, is quite as intimidating as a towering robo knight wielding a gargantuan hammer reinhardt is one of the largest and most powerful close combat heroes in all of overwatch but it's his enormous rectangular shield that uh, has most players uh, cursing their look the first thing you have to understand about reinhardt's shield is that it isn't invincible anyone who's played as a hulking behemoth knows that the barrier has its own health stats heroes with superior power power such as ferret and bastion can shatter a shield in no time if they focus the fire. Just be sure to keep moving if possible, so Reinhardt doesn't have time to line up in a direct hit with his rocket, his rocket power charge. Defeating Reinhardt in a stealthy fashion is all about tiring and precision. Wait until his back's turn and fire off long-range attacks uh, with heroes like Hanzo, Widowmaker, or even Junk Rat. Okay, another tank. Uh, and uh, my suggestion: uh, when Reinhardt has his shield mode, perfect target for. Uh, a frigid blast tracer and Genji can also use a speed to get uh, beyond his shield and take him from behind. Okay, guys, so that is seven characters, the most overused characters, and how to counter them. So if you learned something, obviously give it a like and subscribe. And look forward to some more Overwatch videos. Bye.